Yeah. Before the wedding. Uh, where's Vicky? Isn't it bad luck to see the bride before the wedding? <laughs> don't worry. I don't think anything bad could happen today. I feel so happy. you doing, soldier, huh? Oh, I feel like a general. Oh. Never been better. Good. Although I will admit, I'm glad that Andrew will be leading us through the vows, and all I have to do is repeat them. What? You nervous? Well, oh. what's your secret? I have no secret. I'm very nervous. <laughs> How you feeling, soldier? Oh, I'm feeling fine. Like a general. You think we could tear ourselves away from each other long enough to greet our guests? We can try. <laughs> all right, you kids. You know, you got to be extra special good today, all right? Because it's a very special day. Thank you very much for Aunt Vicky and Uncle Sloan. Uncle Sloan. I like the sound of that. <laughs> of course. Thank you so much for bringing the children by. Yeah, it's my pleasure. Well, I just didn't do it on account of the kids. I wanted to come by and wish you all the happiness in the world because you deserve it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Cord. That means a lot. Happy Thanksgiving, too. Thank you, you, too. Thank you. Come with me, guys. Let's see what we can <laughs> eat. We owe you a lot, Larry. And you've been absolutely wonderful to Sloan through all of this. Well, he hasn't been, at all times, the easiest man to help. You should have heard the fight we had over his trying to hide his illness. I can imagine. All we can say is, thank God I found out. Yeah. Talked some sense into it. Well, I agree with you, Vicky, but you're going to have to be realistic about this. You, know, you and Sloan are in for a, a rough road ahead. Yes, I know. I know. But, you know, we'll deal with it together. Hey, Larry, it's for better or for worse. Will you excuse me for a moment? I don't want Vicky to overdo it. Andrew? Sloan? Is anything wrong? No. <laughs> oh, there is one thing wrong. It's my son. He's eager to see his old man tie the knot. <laughs> oh. Well, for that matter, I'm kind of eager myself. Well, if you're ready, I am. All righty. Let me make sure that everyone is here. Okay. Whoa, where's the fire, huh? Ah, <laughs> uh, Kevin. <laughs> yeah, hi, Mom. You ready? Well, we, we are just about ready, but I need to get everybody here, and I, I can't find Joey. Do you know where he is? Vicki! Yeah, hi. Are we ready to start the main event? Well, I'm, I, I'd like to, but I can't find Joey anywhere. Oh, he said he went out to get some ice uh, a little bit ago. He went out to get ice? Why would he go out and get ice? We have plenty of ice. I don't know. He said he wouldn't be very long. Why don't I go check in the kitchen? I'll see if he's back. I'll come with you. Well, if you're having second thoughts, now is the time to tell me. I have one thought. I want to be Mrs. Carpenter. Mm -hmm. I've waited a very long time for this day. Well, today is good. The day's to come. We'll take it one day at a time. And we will deal with it together. You're a brave woman. No, I'm not. I'm a lucky woman. I'm marrying the most wonderful man in this world. Mm -hmm. I love you so much. I love you, Vicky. I love you. Can we get started? No, we cannot. What's the problem? Well, I, I was trying to find everybody. I can't find Joey. Any idea where he is? He went to get some ice. That was that was quite a while ago. That doesn't make any sense. Mrs. Buchanan, I'm sorry to bother you. There's a woman on the phone. She says it's urgent. Who is it? I don't know. She won't give her name. Thanks, Lois. Excuse me, sir. Sure, no problem. 
Let's hope this is not about Joey. I'm so sorry, Vicky. But your son won't be able to attend your wedding after all. Dorian, what the hell are you talking about? Where is Joey? What is this all about? Oh, Joey is wonderful. Really? And he's right here with me. And this is where he is going to stay for the rest of the day. No wonder my happy heart sings. Your love has given me wings. Oh, by the way, he sends his deepest regrets. Goodbye. Oh, my God. Oh, Joey. Vicki, is everything all right? No. No, it's not. I have to go over there right now. Go? Where? What's wrong? Darling, it's Joey. He's in, he's in some kind of trouble with Dorian. You know that relationship between them that I was yes. so worried about? Well, I'm sorry, sweetheart. I have to leave. I, I will be right back, but I have to take care of this now. Oh, well, I'll come along. No, no. I'll, I'll be all right, honest. I just have to get him away from her right now. Would you talk to everybody and stop them from being restless? If it's this serious, I... I think it'll be okay, all right? I will be right back with Joey, and then you and I are going to get married. Mm-hmm. Okay? All right, don't worry about us. Okay, half an hour tops, I promise you. I love you, too. <laughs> Joey! Joey! Please, tell your friends, your family, that I'm deeply sorry for having ruined your wedding. You haven't? Of course not. No bless oblige. Stiff upper lip. Always carry on. I'm sure it would thrill you to think you ruined my wedding. But you haven't. Sloan and I are going to get married today. And nothing will stop that. Certainly not you. Maybe Vicky. Let me get that. Thanks. Hello? Sloan, uh, I'm very sorry to have kept you waiting. Don't worry about that. Are you all right? Uh, not really, no. What about Joey? What happened? No, no he's, he's all right. I, I, I'll tell you all about it after the wedding, okay? I really just called to tell you that um, I'm, I'm on my way home now, and I'll be there just as soon as I can. And I love you very much. Yes, Joey, it is about me. I know that you would like to believe she cares about you. She, she loves me. And I love her, and you just can't accept that, can you? Joey, if she loves you so much, then why did she call me minutes before I was supposed to get married and tell me that you were here with her? Think about that. She wanted me to come here. She wanted to ruin my wedding day. She wanted me to find you two together in her bed. Well, Jen. Dad, Larry! Larry! Larry, please, help! Andrew, Andrew, please, please. Come on, let go. All right, smart. Right here. Larry, help him, please. Larry, Larry, please. Please, Larry, please. 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 Darling, what's happening? Like, 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 he's out here. He's just lying there. Oh, God, Renee, he has to be all right. He's got to be all right. Come on, kids, let's go up here. Come on. Up here. Oh, Larry, Larry, what can we do? My car's right outside. No, I don't want to take him in that. Uh, Kevin, call an ambulance. Please, got it, got it. Larry, he's going to be all right, isn't he? Larry! Larry, say something. He was my name. I mean, he recognized me. That's a good sign, isn't it? Isn't it? Sloan. Sloan, can you hear me? Sloan. Sloan. 